This is going to be another Fly Right Boy exclusive. All right, guys, gonna be another Flower Boy exclusive. We're gonna do our first startup. Uh, this is a turbine conversion of the MiG 29. And for do the first startup. All right, go. Okay, so, uh, turn the And then just you're gonna double click on your on your uh, trim all the way up, and then go up and down your throttle once, and that'll start the process. You'll see your screen there reading what it's doing. It starts it, it primes first. It sends a little bit of fuel, and then it goes burner on. And it means the burner starts starts to turn on, and you'll see the fuel starting to travel. See the fuel? Okay, let me hold it. Normally this plane, I cruise around about 50, 60 percent, right? Okay. And I'll do a, the occasional full throttle pass, but it's got a lot of power. <laughs> so, wow. So right now you'll see here it's going through its its uh, cooling. See if it's cooling? Yeah. And so that kind of always tells you what it's doing, right? Yeah. But you don't have to fly with that. It adds more weight, and I just. I don't ever put it, leave it in there. I only connect it to if it needs servicing or anything. I've never had to connect it. Or like if you're learning a, a, a new radio. That's so cool. this down here, Kevin, is the, this is your CPU, right? That's your your ECU. It's the, basically, it's the brains of the turbine. Okay. Um, here's your brake controller. And then, of course, this is your GSU, or, so you can see what it's doing. And making the adjustments. Um, this you can always turn it off. Just so that it doesn't leak it in far. It's got a lot of power. That's for sure. So you'll see right here. It says stop. And once you hear, once you, once you hear the engine kind of shut down, then you can disconnect the, the receiver battery. Okay. So the only thing you need to go check out is that mix. Yeah. Really. Um, all your throws are right, so it's just that one rudder to elevator, I'm sorry, rudder to steering mix. I'm, I'm sure I'm missing, I'm not, you know, I haven't flown so long, let's see, there's 
gotta be on a certain video that will help you with the mix. Well guys, this is a free wing MiG-29. Normally it's a 80 millimeter. Uh, yeah, twin, twin, twin eight. It's normally the twin a 80 millimeter. Yeah. And I am, uh, well, Rudy, and now I am running it on a uh, King Tech 70 uh g2 yep um it has three uh tanks it has three yeah it has two in the nacelles your header tank and then this is your uat this basically prevents the bubbles from getting into your turbine okay um and you got about a nine minute flight time with it nine minutes with enough to go around two or three times compared to normally what two to three minutes three minute, three yeah. and a half minute maybe nine yes. minutes on a turbine a real turbine jet. Right? I, I, let me stress that again for y'all viewers. A real turbine jet. Hold on, just, I don't think y'all understand. This is a foam airplane with a real turbine jet on it. I mean, you can see it back here, it's mounted on the bottom. And you can see I, I put aluminum to protect the foam on both sides. So when I said if this thing is going to haul, this thing is going to haul. So now, my other fly right guys and our crew got me involved in this. I, was, I wasn't planning on doing turbines as, as of right now, but fly right Tony, fly right Blair, and fly right Denton got me involved. And all of a sudden, now I'm the first one with the turbine. I don't know how that worked out, but all right. So this is the first startup. We're going to see many, many more of all of us flying these turbines in different shape sizes different planes but uh, uh if you like this content please hit the subscribe button like i said this is the first startup uh main flight coming soon after we get a little few more things uh figured out um uh, but uh we the fly right boys we fly right and we go home and i shall see y'all on the flight line